Brooklyn-born Woody Allen, whose earliest movies were so much about New York, has found great new success and happiness shooting movies in Europe. His last seven have been filmed there, including his latest, To Roam With Love. It is about what else? Love, and it has an all-star cast, including Alec Baldwin, Ellen Page, and Woody himself. Here's a look. Yes, I can I'm, I'm going to take care aqua, of aqua, aqua. Yeah, yeah. No, yes. no, 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 no most recent stuff like Midnight in Paris. Well, I like it a lot more than most critics, apparently. I love It's four interlocking stories. It, he sees Rome as this sort of mad piazza, traffic circles, people coming in and out. It's about a guy who falls in love with his girlfriend's crazy, hyper-literate, from hell girl, girlfriend, <laughs> a gal pal. And that's a big theme for him. It's about the curse and the blessing of celebrity. He's got a lot of balls in the air. And you know, it's amazing, at 76 years old, he is a consummate juggler. Hmm. What do you think? I mean, he went to kind of a slump there. I mean, obviously, some of it had to do with his personal life, I think. But, but he's, in sort of turning to Europe, he's kind of turned things around, hasn't he? Well, yeah, the movies got really crapola, and I, they were very, very <laughs> stale. And I what think, else about him did you like? <laughs> well, well, you know, one of the interesting things is that for in the 70s and 80s, Woody Allen was the center of New York social life. And the more he ran from it, the more people wanted him. And then it soured, you know, he fell in love with his stepdaughter. And Europeans are a little more tolerant of that sort of thing, for better or worse. And, uh, and so he left his beloved New York City. He went over there. It was where the money was. And I think he shed a skin. The Woodman is very good at shedding skins and, you know, taking on new personas. And uh, all of a sudden, he starts making these much lighter, more buoyant, more funny movies with these young, hot actors. And he, he loves him some young, hot actresses. <laughs> and, uh, and the movies are very entertaining. And they transport you to places. And it's always nice when you yes. might not be able to take a vacation yes. yourself to go to Rome with Woody Allen for the summer. And these are American in foreign countries movies, as opposed to, you know, homegrown. He really has a tourist's eye. But that doesn't hurt. I mean, they're, yes, he gives you these wonderful sets. And as I said, you can't uh, uh, underestimate the power of like the hottest actors and actresses mm -hmm. of the moment who all want to work with him for scale. They all want to be in a Woodman movie and they will do anything to do it. They will work for nothing. And uh, it, the, it's a little creepy, I guess, the way his camera kind of leers at these beautiful young women. But, you know, he's, uh, he, it's always been for him about living these, these fantasies, living out these fantasies. And his box office at the same time has mm. bounced back, hasn't it? Well, I guess people forgive him in, in part. Now that he's married uh, Sun Yi and he appears to be happy, they seem like a happy couple. Who would have thunk? And... Uh, and the movies, as I say, are better. I mean, you can't just get away from the fact that he's working. He's making them faster. They're lighter. He's got this wonderful command of the camera. Like, there's not a lot of editing. People rush in and out of the frame. You know, he's got his comic momentum back. It really is like shedding a skin and finding a new voice. And it helps to hear Woody Allen's dialogue spoken with a foreign accent or in a foreign language. <laughs> right. You know, you don't have these usual kind of Yiddish-inflected New York right. rhythms anymore. And it does work wonders for his voice and you know uh, this is that we should all go to Europe and shed our skins and reinvent ourselves That's the way he idea. has I'm up for it uh, me too. <laughs> David Edelstein thanks for being with us this thank morning. you thanks, David.